There's the Winter Olympics, the Summer Olympics, and the ROC Skills Olympics. Thank you for watching KHSD News. I'm Erin Briscoe Clark. Students at the Regional Occupational Center recently tested their skills in hopes of taking home the gold. I wish you nothing but the best today. Sent off with words of encouragement, the 22nd annual ROC Skills Olympians were off and running. Take full! Take full! In some programs, it was a race against time. Uh, taking apart a Honda engine um, down to the bare block and then reassembling it and going to try to start it. In others, a test of manual dexterity and attention to detail as students' skills were stacked up against one another. We're competing against a handful of students from our class. We're going to do hand washing, height, and weight. Each instructor customized the competition and catered to specific skill sets needed for the class. The students here are really uh, excited about the career path they're on. Um, so anytime that they can have a chance to show off to other adults what they're learning here, um, it's a good thing for them. Industry partners volunteered their time to help with the competition. When I said my dog is just lying there. You asked, you did ask a good question. Offering their expertise and by serving as judges. Hey, this has been such a rewarding experience to see students um, really put their best foot forward and to see them so eager and willing to learn. I think that programs like this are just so important in kindling the types of, and fostering the types of um, uh, um, skill sets that these students are going to need going forward in the future. Gold, silver, bronze, no matter the medal, all students walked away winners and are prepared to succeed in their future endeavors. I am here today because I am so proud of this school. Local Congressman Kevin McCarthy stopped by Foothill High School to personally congratulate and recognize state champions, the Foothill boys basketball team. You know, you look at these young students and you see what they achieved. Not only the pride of Foothill, but for all Kern County. The congressman gave each member of the team a certificate. This is the Trojans' first state title since 1988. Point five zero, Arvin High School. Arvin High School's color guard is headed to the world championships, ranked number one in their division. The team won the latest competition held in Las Vegas, and now they're off to Dayton, Ohio on April 3rd. Good luck and go Bears. That's going to do it for this week's KHSD News. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter at KHSD underscore official and at kernhigh.org. I'm Aaron Briscoe-Clark. See you next time.